Well, good morning, and we are inside Main Street again today, and we are at the Hair Loft located at 14 North 11th Street, and I am here with Brittany Kirsch Hello. and Erica Trudeau-Adams. Hello. See, I said it the right way. Yeah, thanks. Oh, good. <laughs> All right. I love your last name, though. Thanks. So, um, guess what we're doing? You are hairstylists, or so, to me, they're hairstylists. Sorry yeah. about that. Salon service. You have a great space here. I remember when we I first walked in about a year ago, and there yeah. was like nothing here. That's right? That's pretty scary. <laughs> so I think it looks absolutely fantastic, and we'd kind of like to hear about your journey to, to get here a year later, a little, and through uh, a pandemic even. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's so, been interesting to I, open a business, and, and especially through a pandemic. So. so, yeah. So how many stylists do you have? There's five of us all together, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. me and Erica are co-owners. Yep. And, and then just kind of yep, we fall we, down. Yep, we chair rent um, to Ben, Marissa, and Casey, and okay. they work with us at Master Cuts. Oh, so. sure. All right. That sounds great. Yeah. And then um, you have five, basically five chairs. You do have a sixth one, but... Yeah, we um, basically use it right now. It kind of has overflow, and sure. then obviously you want to make sure we we're ready to have a new stylist. We find somebody who kind of meshes and fits well, you know, because we're like a family, so oh, we all get along really well. And well, I love your Facebook posts. I mean, that's <laughs> kind of how I keep track of what you guys are doing. Yeah. And the one with the glasses, you were cheering each other on your anniversary. <laughs> that was so much fun. And I think that really showed the vibe you've got going mm -hmm. and how, like, relaxed you are. Yeah. And you are a full-service salon? Um, or close Pretty close. Um, we don't do body waxing, and then we don't do like spa services and stuff. But we okay. do, you know, everything from haircuts, facial waxing, um, colors. We do a lot of color. So, a lot. Yeah. Cool. So if somebody were to ask me as the Main Street director, what's their specialty? Is there is there something I should be letting people know? I bet you have more than one though. With everybody people. has their specialties more of like their strong suits yeah, mm -hmm. yeah definitely um i know Brittany she likes to do a lot of vivids you know bright colored person mm -hmm. very cool <laughs> yeah if you can't tell no i put it in all no. um, you know um ben he's he's fantastic at like men's cuts and stuff nice. um, he's, yes. that's really his strong suit mm -hmm. um you know um kelsey and larissa you know obviously they like to do color and, and that stuff too so they do a really good job on like highlights and so, yeah, everybody does have, like, their niche, I sure. guess, where they kind of yeah. shine more. Absolutely. So, yeah. And I really like the way that you had designed this, the salon to begin with because you're definitely social distancing. You're six feet in between each yeah. station. Okay. And um, what other, like, um, safety measures are you still having to follow as we recover? Um, still just, like, the mask wearing, um, you know, obviously – proper sanitizations and stuff like mm -hmm. that, um, which we are educated in anyways. You know, there's right. there's sanitizations and stuff like that that we have to do besides prior to COVID. Sure. So um, we're kind of used to it on that level anyways, if that makes sense. Um, but basically, you know, we just try and accommodate the guests as best as we can. Mm -hmm. You know, if they have, like, preferences of if, um you know, they'd rather be in here by themselves, you know, that type of thing. We, we communicate really well on making sure that um, we make our guests as comfortable as possible because it is still an ongoing thing. COVID is still right. out there. So, mm -hmm. Almost definitely. I like the fact that you are able to accommodate those clients that cannot or are just not uncomfortable with a lot of people in the space yeah. so they mm -hmm. can be here by themselves. I think that's a great service to give them. That's awesome. Really awesome. So, um, why did you move downtown? Is there, I mean, besides this great space, right? I mean, did you think you, was there a thought behind that or it was just we were, circumstances? We knew downtown was starting to be revitalized. So we kind of wanted to get down here and mm -hmm. kind of watch the process too. Mm -hmm. And we stumbled upon this place and it was kind of, 
works in our favor. Yeah, the stars aligned. <laughs> that's for did. sure. <laughs> and you are right across the street from a project, so you've had a whole year to watch yeah, yeah. progress going on. Yeah. So if somebody doesn't know where your studio or your salon is, um, what directions would you give them? We usually tell them um, just behind like Daniel's Pharmacy. Um, we're right next to the key, mm -hmm. and then um, the second chance. So, um, or Fireside. You know, a lot of people know where Fireside is. So <laughs> that's true too. So fourteen, well, fourteen North Eleventh Street doesn't always resonate. With no, Noble, we so. get a lot of people who end up all over up like Starlight, oh. and we're like, oh no. <laughs> but yeah, they once we tell them, you know, hey, we're we're here, and they're like, oh yeah, okay. No, I so. think you've got a great location. Yeah, here, just off the main drag, so it's a little bit quieter. Yes, mm -hmm. but um, you've got a great you've got a great spot. Yeah. So for people who really do all of their shopping and, and things and um, research online, how, where are you on on Facebook? Do you have a website? Yeah, we you can find us on Google, and that will direct you to our Facebook page too. Okay. And you can book appointments. And, through Facebook and mm -hmm. get in contact with any of the stylists. And you are really fast. I mean, that fast We're, on responding. It's wonderful. We try to be. Yeah. <laughs> it's been kind of crazy right now, you know, but um, we definitely try to be. So, mm -hmm. Really cool. So what else do you want um, Fort Dodge to know about you? Just that. All the stylists from MasterCuts didn't just up and disappear. Yeah. We're still we, here. Yeah. <laughs> We've yeah. had a lot of people been asking other stylists where the MasterCuts crew went so mm -hmm. yeah which is nice because we've had a lot of like people that were like you know they do refer them down here and, yeah. and likewise you know we like to because if you have somebody that you you just you click well with you right. know um it's and with a four-day notice you know we basically just have to like play damage control you know um so we like to make sure that we're directing people to where they, they feel home. So, oh, absolutely. Uh, yeah. You do. You have a relationship with that person who cuts your hair, and you talk about your life while things are going on, and, yeah. Yeah. and the stylist <laughs> talks about their life. So you do. You become really good friends. And, mm -hmm. and Almost family. like family. Yeah, so, yeah yes. exactly. Yes. Okay. Very cool. Well, thank you for letting us come in this morning. Again, we are um, just around the corner from Daniel Pharmacy and Caddy Corner from um, Second Chance. So thank you so much for tuning in today, and I hope you give the girls a call or look them up on Facebook. And what's your Facebook? The Hairloft Fort Dodge. There you go. The Hairloft Fort Dodge. So make sure you check them out. And again, thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you. Bye.